We are getting our first look at new damage from the Cameron Peak Fire. More than 50 buildings and homes have been damaged or destroyed. And firefighters now worried about that warmer weather Stacy was telling us about. Denver 7 Sloan Dickey reports on why this fire is still a threat. Fire sitting right now, it hasn't moved for about the last four or five days. After a week of snow and cold weather, firefighters battling the Cameron Peak Fire have a chance to finally push back on the flames. This is Pingree Park Road. So they're working along here. But time is running out. As the snow is melting, as it's receding, the crew were implementing a plan which they developed when they did, everything was snow covered. The fires burned more than 100,000 acres. It is now the fourth largest wildfire in Colorado history. We've got over 230 miles of fire perimeter out there. So it takes a long time. This is gonna be an effort going on to actually, you know, to try to circle the whole thing. The snow has also allowed officials to survey the damage. They say 54 buildings have been destroyed, including 24 homes. Some of that fuel was real heavy. It was still combustible, still burning underneath the snow. And fire officials say crews will be battling flames once again as the snow melts. Now the upcoming weeks, we'll see what happens. In Larimer County, Sloan Dickey, Denver 7.